Yo, what's good on today's video? I'm gonna show you guys how to make a freeze command. So yeah, let's get straight into it. All right, so let's insert a script into server script service and we will call this freeze script. Let's delete print hello world and we are going to do, we're gonna make a variable first. We need to make sure that only certain users are allowed to use that command, of course, right? So let's do local allowed users is equal to, let's make a table, we're gonna put my username. So obviously put your username, right? We're gonna skip two lines, we're gonna say game.players.players, add equal and connect, function in parentheses, we're gonna put PLR, which is short for the player. Then we're gonna press enter, then do player.chatted, colon, connect, function in parentheses, you're gonna put MSG, which is short for message, then press enter again. And we're going to pretty much split the message by doing local command, we're gonna make a variable again. We're gonna do is equal to string dot sub. In parentheses, you're gonna put message first. Then you're gonna say one comma and wait, uh, colon f r e z. So sub yeah seven okay. And then we are going to do if command is equal to freeze pretty much pretty much what we're saying is um if the first word that a player says like whether it be a sentence or just one word uh message if that is equal to colon freeze then this will happen so you can put the, your whatever name your command is here and so like right but just make sure you change the amount like if you change it to fr or fre then you would do uh four because it's a character counter right so yeah so we're gonna say if command is equal to freeze then local user is equal to string dot sub once again come i mean quote it sorry parentheses i'm sorry guys it's like three in the morning i'm tired message comma then you're gonna do uh nine we're not doing eight because we're skipping a space right so you're gonna do nine, and you're gonna do four i v in pairs, game dot workspace, get children do if v dot name is equal to user, then v dot humanoid dot walk speed is equal to zero, right? There's different ways you guys could do this. You could set the walk speed and jump speed of the character to zero. Um, you could also anchor the parts. I'm just gonna do this, and then I'm also gonna make their jump power zero too, just so that literally they can do nothing. Is equal to zero. Now, just to clarify something, right? Um, when a player re like if a player if a player was to restart like uh respawn themselves or uh reset themselves, I guess or whatever, or someone wants to kill them or whatever or stuff like that, they're like this their uh walk speed and jump power will reset back to the default, back to the normal, whatever your default is for your game, just to let you guys know. But anyway, right, so we've set up our freeze command. What we need now is a unfreeze command, right? Or a thought command. So let's do else if command is equal to uh, unthaw. Let me, ho let's hope that it's the same character amount. Three six, three six. Okay, all right, perfect. If command, okay. So yeah, if command, then and then you guys can literally, you guys can pretty much just copy all this to be honest. Just copy all that, right? And then the only difference is you'd be setting it back to default. Oh my fault, guys. But you guys would be setting it back to default. So six, uh, sixteen and fifty one, I believe. Yeah, I think that's how that is. So yeah, sixteen and fifty one. And this is the default Roblox default, and this is what, just what I have. You guys can change this whatever y'all want, but yeah, okay. Let's go ahead and let's test this out. So I can walk. Uh, let's get my humanoid. So I can show you guys the changes live, I guess. So let's say freeze by 19. 
boom walk speed and jump power set to zero okay i'm pretty sure you guys can hear me press the space bar nothing is happening then do unfree or un wait what was it what did i say i just realized what i said i knew it looked fucking weird i knew it wasn't chipping i'm like i know this looks so weird unthaw like the unthaw is literally the same thing as free you know it doesn't matter but anyway unthaw spy j 19 there we go and now we're able to walk and run there you go that simple guys i mean now we're able to walk and jump that simple guys that's how you make a free slash unfreeze uh command pretty simple and yeah it's definitely something you can it's definitely it's fun and definitely useful to have in your game so yeah if the video was helpful leave a like and subscribe links to my roblox group and discord can be found in the description as always the scripts will be found in the description as well so yeah i'll see you guys thank you guys for watching